There's been more evidence of life returning to normal in the Xinjiang capital, Urumqi. Mosques in the city reopened for Friday prayers, known as Jumu'a Day, the most important for Muslims to pray. Most mosques had been closed for security reasons since the July 5th riots. Zhang Suwei reports. This mosque in Urumqi can hold 300 worshippers. On Friday, about 200 came to pray. This is the 19-year-old Iman. He says freedom of religion is guaranteed, but he has concerns that some might use the occasion to commit sabotage. We hope for closer national unity and greater social stability and development. We also hope our life can continue peacefully. In the city of Kashgar, at the Eid Khat Mosque, Xinjiang's largest, nearly 10,000 gathered to pray with a purpose. I'm 82 years old. I hope that life goes on peacefully. It's the only way for us to have happiness. Today, I've come to the mosque to pray for national unity and social stability. National unity plays an important role in promoting social development and in improving people's living standard. There is no doubt that national unity is a precondition for social development. Xinjiang had about 9,000 mosques in 1984. Today, the region in northwest China has nearly 25,000. Zheng Sui, CCTV.